When you're rich and famous, it's not hard to lose sight of the little people. While it can't be easy to be the center of attention, celebrities have the choice to either be cool about their fans' overzealous adulation or to be a total celebrity jerk about it. Here are some stars who, allegedly, have done some pretty terrible things to us pathetic, regular people. Rihanna. Rihanna is a rude girl, at least to some fans. My co-worker won free tickets and backstage passes to see Rihanna about a year after they were first playing Umbrella on the radio, a former fan told Thought Catalog. When her kids finally got the chance to go meet Rihanna, she was sitting at her makeup booth and refused to face them, or even look at them. When they asked for her autograph, she told the closest backup dancer to forge it for them and shooed them away. In 2014, Rihanna posted a frowny face on Twitter and linked to a picture of a 16-year-old fan's prom dress, which was similar to a Wiley Coyote-inspired costume the singer wore to an awards show a few years earlier. She tweeted, via the Huffington Post, Dark Thought Rises and hashtag prom bat in response to the unit art and shared the bullying image with tens of millions of people alienating countless fans, and completely ruining one fan's prom memories. We had to look up thought, and it's not nice. Justin Bieber Justin Bieber, where to begin? The pop kid has acted atrociously toward his believers. He allegedly spit on fans from a balcony in Toronto, Canada, mooned others at historic Mayan ruins in Mexico, and desecrated an Argentinian flag handed to him by a fan. And that's just the tip of his tantrums. There are numerous reports and videos of Justin losing his cool with fans, and then, in 2016, he declared on Instagram, via time, that he was no longer going to take pictures with fans because he feels like a zoo animal, adding, I realize people will be disappointed but I don't owe anybody a picture. Okay, well, if the Biebs wanted self-aware, Highly restrained fans, maybe he shouldn't have targeted young girls. They're not exactly known for their restraint. Ariana Grande Pop starlet Ariana Grande managed to not only alienate most of her fans, but an entire country when she stated, I hate Americans. I hate America on July 4, 2015 in a California donut shop. She also licked pastries she didn't buy. Her egregious behavior was caught on the shop's security camera. The singer was subsequently nixed from performing at a White House event, reported Us Weekly, despite multiple public apologies. Jamie Foxx One Redditor had a bad experience with actor Django Unchained, 2012, actor Jamie Foxx. Several years ago, when Stealth, 2005, was coming out. They held the premiere at the Naval Air Station in San Diego. They gave a few tickets to the event to the ships that were in port at the time and I was lucky enough to get a pair. Before the showing of the movie, everyone was mingling around and socializing. Jessica Biel, Josh Lucas, the director, producers, and everyone else involved in the picture were very gracious and friendly. Everyone, that is, except Jamie Foxx who sat in his seat the entire time with his sunglasses on and didn't want to be bothered. He could have shook some hands and been cordial, but he didn't. Maybe he can blame it on the AAAAA alcohol. Scarlett Johansson Scarlett Johansson had fans seen red after she left them high and dry. I had just seen a play on Broadway starring Scarlett Johansson, and I was waiting by the stage exit after the play, along with at least 15 other people, for autographs. A fan claimed on Reddit. It was February in NYC, snowing hard, we were all freezing. Each one of her co-stars came out and signed. Scarlett was the very last to exit and she completely ignored everybody. I was younger and it completely crushed me. She was my favorite celebrity and this was my only chance to ever see her. Pretty much everyone who waited 45 plus minutes beside me had the same sentiments. Adam Levine, a fan told Reddit, via Gigwise that the Maroon 5 frontman is reportedly picky about who is and is not worthy of his autograph. I was with one of my girlfriends. She was so excited to get, Adam Levine's, autograph, the fan said. After asking for it, he said, I don't give autographs to ugly chicks. Robert Pattinson Actor Robert Pattinson has dissed the very fans that made him relevant and rich. What's really weird about Twilight fans is that they're not really teenagers. Most of them are older. He told Interview Magazine, 
via Us Weekly. Twilight has its own fan culture that existed from day one and in an intense way that didn't exist before. Sometimes I ask myself what these masses of people do the whole day. They sit in front of their computers and comment on anything having even remotely to do with Twilight.